Hello all. Uh, yesterday, I was digging that cellar hole. And uh, after we left, come back here, I uh, thought I'd stop out through this town. A friend told me about a, a creek he used to go in here and uh, find arrowheads. I thought I'd check it out. Or check it out and uh, end up finding this place. And I seen the, seen the rock had the memorial or the uh, words on it. I had to go see if I could get permission and I went and found out who owned it and I, I got permission. This, I'm gonna go show you here in a second here the uh, the uh, what it is. Okay, y'all, I just dug my first hole and uh, dug up a, uh, I think it's harmonica reed. Pretty cool find. Okay, here's my find for today. For this, we've been out here for like an uh, hour and a half, and this spoon's all we found are here. And uh, this harmonica reed, and a, a big chunk of lead. I don't know what it is. Just a big chunk of lead. I don't know if it's melted or just melted or what. But that's all it is. It's kind of cool though. I don't know. What. Probably just keep it. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the hunt. Wasn't much of a hunt. I didn't find nothing good. Dug them up. I didn't film it. But this, I guess this could be the end of the video unless I can find another place to go to between now. It's just, it's just noon. So if I find something else, someplace else better, this place would have been good if I hadn't put all the dirt in there. They, uh, that farmer brought at least about a foot of dirt and put it covered that and you can't get down to the good stuff i think if he hadn't done that we would have found some stuff good stuff there to show you you would dig up but oh well it happens people always running history and messing it up so anyways till till next time happy hunting Stay safe. Hello everyone. Well, just wanted to recap on this hunt for a school, a former school site. Wanted to apologize for the shortness of the video. Like I said, I kind of figured I was, when I went there, I was all excited, thought, you know, 1835, that's pretty old, especially for a schoolhouse. And I even debated on even making this video, just I was thinking about deleting it. But I thought, well, at least there'd be some kind of documentation of it. If something ever happens to that rock that's sitting there with the writing on it, memorial to that school, or whatever, however you want to phrase it. But the. Uh, Just want to apologize for it. I hope you enjoy what I've got. Like I said, that harmonica reed, and, that's, and that big chunk of lead is what I dug up at. Was even decent. I thought I'd keep. And my dad's the one that dug the spoon up. Seemed like it was fairly old. I'd say maybe 
thirties, fifties. Just, just as an educated guess. Like I said, I hope you enjoy the video. I'm sorry it's so short. I think we'll have to wait till next year. Next, after he, the farmer piles it and dis, discs it and, all, and plants it, then harvests it again. Maybe by the end that the, that dirt that he put piled on there, I mean, it, a lot of dirt. Maybe by the end he'll, uh, it'll sink down a little bit and thin out. Maybe I can go back then, find something good. But until then, I might have another site. Uh, I got, I'm waiting on a call back from him. Just let me know. I know he's going. To, they're going to let me. But uh, it's just fact when I, but it's going to be certain. It ain't going to be like most permissions I got where I just go back, go and detect any time I want and have an ongoing permission. I got a. I want to have have the one of the owners there. And he's going to kind of walk along with me to, he's kind of curious, I guess. He wants to be there and see what I dig up, and we're just fine. And, if I, and when I do get to go, all, all the fines are getting donated to the place. It's kind of like a, uh, it made a museum out of the place, sort of. I guess. And there's also, they have... Again, you know, back at when I made that video, a couple videos ago, uh, the orphanage video, the haunted orphanage. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh God, this place they have paranormal paranormal tours too. It's supposed to be haunted, also. It's a it's a big place, a building and all. It's got a lot of ground. But they have paranormal tour tours and our tours, which I think is ridiculous. I mean, what, what are they expecting to find? Casper? <laughs> I think it's probably ridiculous, but I guess these places, I guess, it helps make money and stuff, especially for the cause. But the uh, like I said, if you believe in that kind of stuff, if you choose to, that's your choice. But anyways, I'm, I can't, I'm excited about that one, even though I'm, I'm uh, giving up all the fines, donating all the fines I find to the place. Which is fine, because it's going for, you know, it'd be preserved in history, hopefully. They'll put it in display cases up there and display them and share it with the community and the, you know, people. But anyways, I just wanted to share this video, or share this with you and let you know my plans, what's going on in my future, in our future. My plans for my next videos and my metal detecting. But it's what a little bit of what it's going to consist of. But anyways, hope to see you soon, and I'll let you know on this as soon as I get this new permission. I'll take you along with me and let you see and experience the fun I want to have. We're going to have and maybe we we'll see a ghost along the way. What do you think? Sorry, I can't put that one on that one. But anyway, please subscribe and like to my, to my channel and videos. I really need it. <laughs> so, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy. As always, happy hunting and stay safe.